4.5 billion years ago, Earth was born, but it didn't look anything like it does now. For millions of years, it was a fireball, molten rock, toxic gases, no oceans, no life. But then something changed. Massive asteroids rained down, carrying water frozen in their cores. Steam filled the sky, clouds formed, and then it rained for thousands of years. Eventually, oceans covered most of the planet, and beneath those waters, something miraculous happened. Life. Simple, single-celled, barely alive by our standards, but they changed everything. They made oxygen, they made the atmosphere, and for the first time, Earth could breathe. Now fast forward two billion years. Suddenly, Earth freezes. A global ice age. Glaciers stretch from pole to equator. Even the oceans begin to freeze. But somehow, life survives. And when the ice melts, it comes back stronger. Then comes the Cambrian explosion, 500 million years ago. Life doesn't just grow, it erupts. Insects, plants, fish, everything we know begins here. But Earth isn't done changing. Massive volcanic eruptions block out the sun. Oceans turn to acid. 90% of all species vanish. But again, life comes back. Stronger, smarter, stranger. And then, dinosaurs. For 160 million years, they ruled this world. Until 66 million years ago, a rock the size of a city hits Earth. The sky burns, the ground shakes, darkness covers the world for months, and when the light returns, the dinosaurs are gone. But not everything died. Tiny mammals rise, they grow, multiply, and one day stand on two legs. Humans. Only 300,000 years ago. We are just the last page of a story 4.5 billion years long. Earth has been a fireball, a snowball, a paradise, a graveyard, and it will keep changing long after we're gone. So the next time you feel small, remember this. You are part of something ancient. A living planet that has died and been reborn again and again. And somehow, for a brief moment in time, you're here to witness it.